Are you having problems using your headphones as a remote trigger in the Stop Motion Studio app? Well, so was I. So here I'm going to talk you through some of the remedies for getting your headphones to work and enable a remote trigger when using the app. Now, the theory is that if you have a pair of headphones and you plug them into your phone, you should be able to use the buttons, the up volume button in particular on the headphones to uh, take a picture. But as you can see, no matter what button I push on my headphones, absolutely nothing is happening. No pictures are being taken. So why is this? Well, one fix that I've found is, like me, you might have your phone on silent. So you can see silent mode was enabled. If I take the silent mode off, that can then make the headphones work. So if you're on silent, that is going to disable the volume functionality. So take your phone and put it on full volume and then try again. As you can see, in my case, it's still not working. I found this incredibly frustrating. I was actually making other tutorials on how to use this app and I wanted to use my headphones and it just wouldn't work. So the next logical step, if you're having the same issue as me, well, it's got to be the headphones that are the problem because if you look, if I tap here, we're able to take a picture. And if we use the volume buttons on the actual phone, if I push one of those, it takes a picture too. So the problem here is definitely my headphones. Now I've cleaned the headphone socket and I've made sure that the connector is fine and there's no problem there. So I think that the buttons on my pair of headphones have just stopped working. And you may find that that's the problem with you as well. So I went and got a second pair of headphones that also had the button functionality on them. Now, if I plug in this pair of headphones and I get my little buttons here, straight away, it takes a picture. So if you too find that you have an issue with your headphones not working and your phone is on full volume and it still isn't working, then it might just be your pair of headphones. Try a new pair if you've got one, ask a friend, ask a family member if you can borrow some. And if you just push the positive button, the up volume, you'll find that it does indeed still take a picture. So using headphones as a remote trigger in Stop Motion Studio or Stop Motion Studio Pro is still, in my opinion, the cheapest and best method for taking remote pictures. It's really, really simple. And it means you don't have to touch your phone at all because if you're going in there every frame and tapping here to take your picture, you're gonna get all this wiggle and it's gonna look really unprofessional. But if your phone is on a tripod or it's stuck down steady somewhere and you're able to just trigger the pictures like this without having to go in and move your phone at all, then you're going to get perfectly smooth and professional looking animations. I hope you found this video helpful. I've got other videos on how to use different features in Stop Motion Pro. There's a playlist on my channel and all of them are linked in the description box.